In this video, we will learn how to create and use custom middleware in ASP.NET Core application. While working with real-time applications in ASP.NET Core uh, web API, we need to create custom middleware. For the best practice, we will create separate class in our application, then we will write the code over there. Uh, let's add a new class in our project. So right click on project, then click add, then click class name your class custom middleware to work with the middleware we need to inherit this class from i middleware now add the namespace this i middleware is belongs to microsoft.aspnetcore.http now I don't need this extra codes so let's remove it. We need to implement this method um, for I middleware. Okay, we can simply uh, do this. Choose this option implement interface. We got a new invoke async method. Now we can write code inside this. So instead of this line I want to copy this code from use method and paste it now change the output type to use the await keyword uh, we have to use um, async here okay now change the output text i want to show the output as custom middleware incoming request and custom middleware outgoing response remember while calling the next method uh, from any custom middleware we need to pass the this context object here so copy this and paste it here now save the changes now we have created custom middleware as separate file we have to use this middleware in our HTTP request pipeline now uh, create this uh, middleware as separate service in this application for that uh, go to startup if you want to use any kind of service uh, in ASP.NET Core application before using that service, we have to inject it uh, in our application. So we can inject the service using this um, configure service method of the uh, startup class. Let's, uh, let's add the service here. Services dot add transient. Inside this, we have to pass the custom middleware we will discuss about this add transient in our future videos now we just use this method to configure the custom services so far we have created a custom middleware uh, in our application we are injecting this service in this application so we have to use the custom middleware in this application by inserting the code in the HTTP pipeline um, for that go to configure method so in configure method I want to insert the code here let's write app dot here we need to use this uh, method use middleware your custom middleware Yeah, we need to use this uh, use middleware method in this method uh, we passed custom middleware uh, that's it save the changes now build the solution now run this application see you
um, we have the output from custom middleware this is um, from um, first middleware this is from custom middleware this is from second middleware this is from um, third middleware um, now second middleware third middleware to custom middleware and then uh, first middleware this is how we can use all these methods in middleware i hope you enjoyed this video thank you so much